Okay, Virgo, hello. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you for all of the subscribers. Uh, I just wanted to let you know if you are not 18 or older, you can go ahead and click off of this channel right now because this is for 18 or older reading. Also, if you would like a personal reading, I will be starting personal readings, okay? So keep I'll keep you posted on that. Just ring that notification bell. So Virgo, <laughs> this is a first. I decided to bring my little babies out, all right? These are my little sexual tarot cards. Um, this is sexual magic tarot. So the questions we're going to be asking about is about your person, all right? Whoever's on your mind, what are their fantasies? You know, how freaky are they? And like, what are their fetishes? What, what, do you, what you do know, what you don't know, what they like that you do, you know, stuff like that. So here with the Ace of Cups, <laughs> with the Ace of Cups, I see that, that you give them sheer ecstasy. I feel like your person is very happy with you. They like to just lay in bed with you and um, they like to do a lot, like love making pretty much. They like to share that cup with you. They like, they... <sighs> I'm hearing they like to fill you up, whatever that means, or they like it when you fill them up. Oh my god. <laughs> um, I'm also getting here where they 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 like it when like they guilt trip you. As as since as far as like it goes, like when you they tease you when they're like, you know, if you do this, you know, I'm gonna do this. Kind of like a punishment, but like playfulness. Ooh, where'd that come from? Very fiery energy. I do see here water, a lot of water energy, Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, Swords, Aries Leo. <laughs> Aries Leo said. Um, I do see here a lot of um, air as well. With the Five of Swords, this is telling me like um, shaking things up. They like, ooh, they like when you're spontaneous. They like that spontaneous like sexuality. They like that you're spontaneous in general or like when you guys want to do it, when you guys are just like out of nowhere. They also like to do it, I feel like, in places where there's a lot of people but you guys can hide. You guys can look outside where people are at, but they like the people can't see you like the crowd can't see you is what I'm getting and it's <laughs> with the justice card okay this is also giving me air energy right Gemini Libra Aquarius so the justice is getting like meeting right you guys meet up like not necessarily at a, at a home or something sometimes me you guys just want like a real quick quickie <laughs> and you guys just have the tendency to do it anywhere like in, in your cars or like in a bathroom you guys please be careful if you guys are going to like some rando bathrooms restrooms whatever <laughs> the Ron is out there still the strength card leo energy uh oh okay this is giving me the lovers to gemini again water water energy and fire energy this person can be very feisty they <clears throat> They can be very dominant or they like it when you're dominant. Either way, you guys have that passion that intertwines with each other and they have the tendency of liking that. They have the tendency of liking that hard to get type of notion and you could play the role in that very heavily. Virgo, because I feel you're, I mean, Virgo is like all about solitude, right? So this person... Uh, I feel like they do the chasing most of the time, but when you actually come out of your shell, you're quick, you're spontaneous, you're like, hey, like, let's go behind this building, you know, <laughs> and then just do it. Wow, Virgo, what happened to being, you know, in your own solitude, right? Anyway, with the lover's card here, Gemini energy, this is giving me like a soulmate, right? You guys, um... For some of you, it could resonate. For others, you know, take however it goes. This is also giving me <laughs> the sense of, like, seduction, right? The, the like, red magic. The red magic of plants. So, ooh, look at that. Death, new beginnings. As well as it's, like, uh, maybe abandonment. Like, there, you guys could have uh, separated for a while. Or maybe you guys just... <laughs> You guys, um, 
what is that called? Like when when you arouse someone to the point where and like where they're about to climax and then you just stop. I think I don't know. I forget what it's called, but that's what they like to do. Uh, I'm hearing like oh edging. There you go. So <laughs> there's that. I mean they like to do that because it's just, it's like a climax that they like. And for some of you, you guys could like climax together and that's very very powerful for some of you you guys might do sex magic um don't take you know if they if you don't take however it resonates i also see here virgo where your person has the tendency of savoring you they save every moment with you like just sitting down relaxing they like to feed you they think that this is very sexy um i also do see here where this again you guys could <laughs> he could like he oh man he or she like your person could feed you and then they just want to fuck you <laughs> to get you ready to give you that energy because i feel like your person can go for a couple of rounds if you know what I mean also with the chariot cancerian energy again very emotional I feel like there's a lot of love that goes in here along with passion they do like to watch you squirm I'm getting um they do like to play with your hair I also see here where they can't get their hands off of you at times this person might watch you sleep they think you're a, like a little cute angel very beautiful very sensual and they can't they they like are thankful for like man you know this person is like everything that i want and and they they fuck really well like <laughs> so yeah this is um where it shows like conquest they also like it when they tire you out and they're like yeah i did that like that's on me virgo slumped out because i mean can we get one more please two of pentacles dun 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 this is giving me heavy um embarrassment maybe <laughs> maybe at one point you guys were caught and it could have like embarrassed them maybe it i feel like it could have been over at your like at your family's house friend's house or vice versa it could be at like where you guys know whose house it was whose place it was and you guys got caught so <laughs> yeah that's what i'm picking up you guys oh my god you guys are so cute but there's a lot of passion your person do does like um to be around you they do like to feel you out a lot so yeah i i'm i'm hearing um that song morning morning like can i hit it in the morning yeah i forget what it's i think it's j cole I'm not sure. Look that up. I'll I'll put it in the description box. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So maybe you guys might have not taken the next step. Take however it resonates. And this person actually wants to take the next step with you. Maybe you guys were just, you know, friends with benefits at this point. But this person, um, if you guys aren't, if you guys are in a relationship actually, then this person, like after you guys fuck, like like let's say again with the picnic being outdoors they feed you they fuck you and then they talk to you pretty much <laughs> so this person like they can they can do all they can do all aspects and i feel like you're very um you're the same way too right so let's see let's get some more romance oracles out here for virgo please for it okay Healing family issues, your love life benefits as you as you forgive your parents. Okay. This is telling me where you know this card for this one, I'm gonna read it intuitively. I feel like I feel like this your your family might not approve of this person or vice versa but the thing is they don't know what you guys have they only see the outside and then that's how you guys should keep it you know that's none of their business and this person or holds the qualities that you you want in in um a companion or vice versa and this is why they're so they're so like mesmerized they're so 
they find you so alluring. They find you very, they have that attraction for you, right? That's why they're always in ecstasy because it's you, you fill them like nobody's filled them before. Like I said in the beginning, they like to fill you up. I think it's like, you know, when they come, <laughs> they like to see all their own juices all over you. Wow. This is like the most raunchy I've ever gone on my page, on my YouTube. So, man, I'll put a big ass 18 or over sign up on the description box because y'all are wild. Virgo, you ain't no hermit, let me tell you. Can I get one more, please, for Virgo? One more, please, for Virgo. Okay, so I'm getting nothing, so that's pretty much it. Express your love, pretty much. You know, either go the next step or just stay how it is, right? Like, you guys are doing great, pretty much. So let's get one lover's oracle out here for you to close out your reading. So yeah, if you made it this far, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you like these types of readings. Like I said, I really don't like take out a lot of my cards. They're pretty like, I do pretty basic ones, you know, try to like uplift you guys. Okay, let's see what this one is. Romance. <laughs> Cupid's arrow strikes. Look at that, that passion, that fire. I feel like they, when they connect with you, your, 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 like, heart chakras ignite. And one of you guys has a lot of passion. You guys, have, either Virgo, you could have a lot of fire energy, a fire element in your birth placement, your birth charts, your birth chart placements, in your placements, right? Or you're, you could be dealing with a fire, a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. All right. So Virgo, this has been your reading. Um, don't forget to, again, ring that notification bell, okay? Don't forget you, um, you are, like, stay positive, be positive, you are positive. Damn, you guys got me all fucked up. Bye.